Today we sniff some tasty oxygen. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Oxygen, it's all around you. Breathe it in. But don't get your hopes up because you know what? It's mostly nitrogen. It's only 20.95% oxygen and about 78% nitrogen and there's some other gases that are not really important. Argon, carbon dioxide, you know, that kind of stuff. And sometimes 20.95% oxygen is just not enough and some enterprising people have decided to make oxygen bars. Uh, which are businesses where you go in and sit down on a stool, put uh, some tubing in your nose, <laughs> and suck in pure, uncut, oxygenated mm. oxygen. They Sounds say that fun. there's all types of benefits to this, including removing toxins, enhancing well-being, reducing stress, strengthening your immune system, and even curing cancer. Mm, they say, yes, but you know what? They also, instead of just making you sniff the oxygen, said, let's make this fun and let's flavor that oxygen. That's a thing that exists. And today we're going to find out if we can tell what flavor oxygen is by sniffing it in our noses. It's time to play. What flavor is this oxygen that we be breathing in through tubes in our noses, friend? Here we are at the oxygen bar. Party time. Um, it is tended by uh, a bartender. Didn't necessarily come with it. it. The guy looks a lot like Chase. Though. Hello, barkeep. Uh, what's your name? Hi, I'm uh, Chasse. This is very sciencey looking. There's like bubbles coming out of bottles that are colored differently. Is it safe? Absolutely. You don't know. It's oxygen. He's never you done this. Know. We just put you back there and told you to turn some valves. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so so uh, we should get hooked up here. We've got um, the oxygen nostrilators. I've never put That's one the of these name. on. This is like what they do at the hospital. Doesn't go over your head, dude. <laughs> it goes, look. See, I've never done put it before. It, nostrilate it. Oh. And then. That's kind of nice. Put it on the ears. Ear mm. it up. Oh. And then bring and her down. Tighten it down. And then. Right there. I feel like we're both going into surgery together, which we should do, by the way. I've been meaning to talk to you about that. We both need a little. Ch -ch -ch. My ears we are a little together. A little tightish. Are you saying perform the surgery or have surgery performed on us in tandem? We should do it together and hold hands at the same time. Right, like the like the one where they uh, make it where you can't make babies. Yeah, that one. Yeah, let's talk about that later. For now, we're just going to oxygenate. Round one. All right, the tubes are connected, mm. Chasse. It smells like plastic Serious? oxygen right now. Well, he hasn't opened the valves oh. yet. Have you, <laughs> Chasse? Nope, I'm about to right now. All right, you guys know what we're smelling, but we do not. Ooh, is that it? Just breathe. There you go. I don't know how to do this. <laughs> you don't know how to breathe? I don't know how to do it, man. Just breathe, man. It's subtle. It's uh, refreshing, yet subtle. It's very subtle. Is it flowery? It's very pleasant. It's got a it's got a tangy sweetness to it. I find doing this helps. Is that recommended? I I, I have a guess. I have my guess too. All right, three, two, one. Orange. Roses. You're saying orange? Roses. <laughs> it's called the Grove, which is no, orange. it's citrusy. <laughs> oh man, you nailed it. You didn't get it's, I, I, it. Was either lemon, grapefruit, or orange, and I went with orange. Oh, dude. I'm not off to a you good start. You said roses? <laughs> you know what roses smell like, right? Yeah, like this. You got the wrong valve open on me? <laughs> <laughs> Round two. What's good here, bartender? I recommend number two. <laughs> <laughs> Smelling number two. I still smell orange. You gotta clear the, the pipe of the orange Bro, roses. But I'm also smell. starting to feel good. Are you invigorating? I feel smarter. I feel like I've got a sixth sense. It kind of builds, but it starts subtly. Are you getting it yet? I'm gonna do my thing. Hold on. I think I just need to get nothing but that in there. Oh, that doesn't help at all. Oh, really? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not getting a scent yet. I, I mean, I have a guess. Are you getting a read? I'm not getting a read at I'm all. I'm getting a read. Yeah. I gotta shake my tube or something, <laughs> man. Shake your tube. That'll solve everything. All right. I. Mm. All right. Three. Two, one. Lavender. The answer was uplifting, which is peppermint. <laughs> peppermint? <laughs> Hold on a second. I didn't get any peppermint in that one. I wanna go ahead and say that I've been cheating by looking at the color of the bubbles. And so I said orange for the first one because it was orange. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Round three. All right, Chasse, fire this one up. All righty. Mm. And 
I think I'm gonna give you guys the name of this one without the aroma. This okay, we get a hint. Oh, you oh, think yeah. we need some help? I, I think I think you might need it. This one's called Invigorating. Oh, that is so helpful, Chasse. <laughs> You're welcome. I'm being invigged. I don't think that leather would be one of them. Leather is invigorating for you? <laughs> no, well, when worn where? I'm just saying, leather's the first thing that came to my mind when I started to analyze the smell. I think I know it. Mm, what color is it? It's clear. <laughs> is, is mine in right? No, dude. <laughs> You've got one right in. Shove it up your nose. Oh. <laughs> and now breathe through your nose. Oh, I've got this one. I'm all over this. All right, guys, in three, two, one. Pine. Pine. Blackberry. <laughs> what? 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 Blackberry? Hold on. Blackberries <laughs> grow under the pine tree. <laughs> oh. Round four. Pine, huh? Fire it up, Chasse. Oh. Oh. This one is called tropical. I feel like I could do more right now. We so should like, be doing something productive besides sitting there and smelling oxygen. We could have like cords that go on for like 50 yards and we could just. I want it all the time. What is it? Oxygen, man. I, I, what flavor? Oh. You, <laughs> you don't even have a clue? Tropical, huh? Tropical. I'm going, I'm going to the tropics via my nose holes. Uh, I think I might know this one because I'm guessing something that's tropical and then I'm trying to confirm it with my smell buds and I believe that I, it's happening. I, it's like I'm on vacation should, right now. I feel like we should fight right now or something. Don't you feel like you could like, I, I feel like we could go like 12 rounds bare knuckle. I feel like I could bust through a wall. <laughs> yes. Not a physical wall, more like an emotional wall. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna guess. All right, gentlemen, in three, two, one. Pina colada. Pina colada. Yes! Yes! Don't you taste the pina colada? Round, Round five. five. What's in a pina colada? It's rum, coconut milk, and pineapple juice. So, technically, you can get a third of a point. We'll give you a third okay. of a point. All right. For that. Give All right. Yeah, the coconut poor guy is a third a of a third of a point. What's the ratio of coconut in a pina colada? Oh, we're not going to get that technical. It's, it's 90% of you're a pina gonna, colada. You're going to lose that battle if you pina go down colada. that road. All right. Is this one going, Chase? You guys are going. This one is a uh, timber. Mm. Okay, so it's it's a tree. We've already guessed pine one time. It's not as strong as what I thought was pine before. No, Which was it's what? Not. What was that? Blackberry? Blackberry is <laughs> pine. This is not pine. I'm thinking oak. Why would they make oak? <laughs> I don't know. I think you should guess oak. I mean, why would they make pine? Are they just smell some pine? Timber? I feel like I could see longer. Like I just saw. Like for I a just... longer duration? <laughs> and for a longer distance. You're like an owl. You're becoming an owl. Do you not feel these things? I feel like my eyes no. got, t like if there I don't a, even smell anything. If there was a knob on the back of each eye, it was like somebody went in and was like, boop, turn it up. But my laser vision is not helping with my smell of vision. It, they're all so subtle to me. But I think that if it was more, if it was any stronger, you'd get tired of it. But this way you just keep sniffing and sniffing yeah, and yeah. sniffing and sniffing until time's up. Hold on, I feel like I can see longer. <laughs> no. All right. I uh, can, man. I got a, I got, I've got my guess. I got a guess, too. <laughs> okay. In three, two, one. Cedar. Spruce. Cedar. Spruce. It's Cedar. Christmas tree. Mm. Uh, Spru Spruce. Spruce. That's what? a Fraser fir, man. Oh, Fraser look fir. up how, what percentage of Christmas trees <laughs> are spruces. Well, uh, Christmas trees are fir trees, pine trees, and sp spruce trees, so I feel like uh, we should give it to you. Point. A third of a point. Round, Round six. six. Release the oxygen. There you go. Breathe. Oh, it's taking me somewhere. You know, scents tied to memory stronger than actually even being there. I don't think that's exactly how the saying goes. I think it's the strongest sense tied to memory is smell, but go with that. I'm going to a funeral. You smell embalming liquid? Yeah. I feel like I'm at a funeral for my great aunt. What? And um, I didn't know her that well. Uh, she only had this one leg. This smells like your great aunt? Yeah, she only had one leg. Yep, I've got it. I need a hint, man. This one is called Summertime. Aunt Hazel did not die in the summertime. <laughs> okay. It was the dead of winter. I think you followed the smell of Aunt Hazel down a rabbit hole. Summer, summer, summertime. We just sit okay. back and suck in oxygen. I, I still am a little bit sidetracked with how I feel. And I, I like now I feel like I should write a poem. 
I feel like I could write it I right could now. Just write it. Bust it out. Here we are at the oxygen bar. We're gonna go home together in a car. If we die before we wake, at least this oxygen we got to taste. I mean, I just came up with that. Wake and taste On do the not sp- rise. Yeah, they do. <laughs> Call him and in. He'll tell you. I have an answer. I got the answer. I have the answer. All I right. know this. In three, two, one. Watermelon. Honeysuckle. Watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> Honeysuckle. I don't know, man. It didn't smell uh, like watermelon. You, you need to take it out and twist. <laughs> do I have the eight left and the right I and the right and the, the left? I think you got the left and the right mixed Dang up. It. That's what it is. Yeah. You ain't getting it all I backwards. I knew it was something. Because watermelon backwards is honeysuckle. Round seven. I've only got a third of po- the point. That's better than zero. When I woke up this morning, I can only breathe out of one nose. Oh, here come the excuses. That's my handicap for take, this, man. I will take mercy, and you know what? Let's say from here on out, they're worth two points apiece. Maybe you can close the gap. All right, I'll I close your gap. I also feel like I could do a lot of math. Eight times seven. It's 56. Seven times six. 42. Nine times eight. 72. One plus three. Four. Four plus three. Fruit. Wow, that's good. I need to go back and take the SAT right now. I also need a hint. I call this one Serenity. I think this is like something you get in a spa. You know how if you go to some spas, a small woman will walk on your back? My back is so big, I had two women stand on my back one time. I had a woman on my back one time and I thought it was two women. It was her knees and her elbows. Yeah. We should go get a massage. I feel like I could give a great massage right now. I, I, I would know exactly I don't need what one. your trigger points are. <laughs> I have an answer. I think you've already guessed this. I don't know. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. All right, guys. In three, two, one. Lavender. Vapor rub. Lavender. <laughs> I can smell better than he can. <laughs> you know, <laughs> man, I guessed that earlier. Can you I get did. some You did. I told point? you, and I told you that you, you guessed told. it earlier. I thought you were red, giving me a ret herring. No, I wasn't. Round eight. I mean, it's okay. I'm a better smeller. <laughs> I'm a better smeller. This one's worth six points oh, for okay. the win. Ooh, this is by far the strongest one. Is my mind just now waking up to what my nose has been experiencing well, this whole time? let me ask you a couple of questions. Do you feel like we should fight? Can you yes. do math? Can you yes. come up with an impromptu yes. poem? Can you see longer? Yes. Because those are all the things that have been happening to me. Like, give me some math equations. 7.2 times 8.3. 50. Uh, 59.1. <laughs> you don't know it either. That's right. <laughs> 59.1. This is strong, guys. Whenever I go to the oxygen party bar, I'm going straight for this one. I need a hint. This one is chilling. How's chilling different than serenity? It's well, not. It's, this is a stronger version of serenity. It's like when you serene really hard, you start chilling. No, chilling is very serene, but you're also cool at the same time. Oh, coldness. Climb on my back, dig your knees and your elbows in, because I'm ready to guess. Okay, in three, two, one. Vanilla. Menthol. Eucalyptus. Mm. I was about to say eucalyptus. <laughs> but you didn't. I was this close. Menthol and eucalyptus have a similar experience. Uh, okay. All right, congratulations, Rhett. You, you earned right. it, man. Outright. And you know what? You win the prize, which is a lifetime supply of oxygen Woo! and nitrogen and everything else that's in the air. <laughs> Suck away, I'm man. Like a superhero. Breathe in. It's like you can steer your own head. <laughs> Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi, my name is Elizabeth, and this is Ivy, and we're from McAllen, Texas, and it's time to spin the Wheel of Mythicality. Our friends, the Gregory Brothers, songified an episode of Good Mythical Morning, and you could go see that on the Extras channel, link in the description. The wheel got lower. Whoa, what happened? Click through the Good Mythical Morning, we're gonna get the crew to taste some of this oxygenase. Oh, somebody wants something, Liz. Congratulations to Lillian Rose. You win a personalized GMM. When Lily Anrose eats asparagus, asparagus. Lily Anrose pee smells, smells like roses. roses. I went to see Rhett and Link. Uh-oh. And with the oxygen, he turned pink. Oh, oh that's it. <laughs> <laughs>